The life cycle begins when bacteria enter the bloodstream from various infection routes and evade the immune system or antibiotics. Formation begins with attachment of planktonic bacteria to the surface, preconditioned with proteins from the host immune system. Irreversible attachment to host proteins signals the bacteria to create biofilm and is the first committed step of biofilm growth. The bacteria anchor themselves permanently using cell adhesion structures such as pili and receptors called epitopes. This encourages new bacteria to attach to newly arriving cells, providing adhesion sites and building the protective matrix of the biofilm structure. Cells now communicate via quorum sensing and use small molecules to regulate gene expression within the bacterium. The community grows through both cell division and recruitment. The development of this complex biofilm makes the community resistant to the immune response and antibiotics. It may include diverse species of bacteria, yeasts, minerals, and host proteins. Recruited neutrophils result in a cascade of inflammatory cytokines and host proteases. These damage tissue and regulate fluid accumulation and exudate, providing nutrients. Bacteria now exist in multiple forms in metabolic states. Now a different phenotype, both physically and metabolically, it has the survival advantages of diversity and multiple defenses. The life cycle continues as fragments or planktonic bacteria are released to reinfect the human host.